Game number five of what has been a brilliant day of under 18's Six Nations Festival of Rugby. The rain has eased off, France are back, fresh off a sensational opening performance against Scotland. But this is a different 15. In fact, numbers 1 to 15, apart from Ines Zeze wearing 23, who's going on the blind side flank. One of these players would have watched that performance no more than an hour ago and really wanted to get into it. However, it is our first look at the home team. No daffodil hats in the stands, but there are flags, sunglasses, beanie hats, pretty much summing up the day here in Colwyn Bay at Stadium CSM. It's been a great venue and it's produced some great rugby. The story of the day so far, England kicked things off with a comeback victory against Ireland, 19-12. Then Italy managed to snatch a draw from the mouth of victory as England came back to tie 1919, then Ireland, superb, one of the performances of the day to beat that Italy team 20 0. However, the performance of the day has come from that group, France. 34 0, they were victors over Scotland. They were fast, they were strong, they were powerful, and they're looking to make it two from two. However, standing in their way, the hosts, Wales, listen to the noise. A lot of expectation, a lot of promise around this group, a lot of talent in their own right, but legacy as well. Hello, Pierce in the second row, Wentley and Pierce's relative. So, Bradwin Metcalf, Nell Metcalf's sister. Runs deep, the expectation runs high. The famous red shirts run out in Wales at Stadium CSM. Back to back games for Wales to close out the day. First of all, they take on France, then they take on Scotland. Nobody has managed two wins from two yet. Ireland, one win, one defeat. England, one win and one draw. Italy, one draw. And one defeat as we take a look at this Wales team. James Williams and Hill in the front row. Pierce and Band in the engine room. Gill, Mitchell and the captain Metcalf at 6, 7 and 8. Lily Hawkins and Hannah Marshall at half-backs with Sarah Jones and Marnie George on the wings. Hannah Lane at full-back. Mullen and Tudor at 12 and 13 respectively. Head coach, former Wales captain, Shuan Lillycrap, has selected preparation for that soup win against Scotland in the warm up game. They put over 40 points on them. As for France, they have rung the changes. Perrine Fanien played fullback an hour ago. She's back in at scrum half with Charlie Gaia in a half back pairing. Mazoki Witton. And Folly 2 wearing 18 are the front row. Wearing number 20, Anna Danielle packs down at lock with Zarsson Bakar. At 7, Lamour, 8, Gienest, and Zizi wears 23. 9 to 15 are where you would expect them to be. And those, the replacements benches. Wales, a bit more traditional. Only naming 23 for this one. They will shake the bingo balls for the second game. That team has already been announced, but we will wait for this result to come through first. Okay, catch him out and an excellent game. She will be rested on the bench for this one. Clotilda. in charge of this one. Of course, all the referees representing the home nations too. We've had Katie Byrne, Berenice Pralli, Marie Pringle. Scotland, France and Ireland respectively. Yeah. 
afternoon. Springtime sunshine, still a bit of breeze. Wales are going to be playing into the breeze in this game. 35 minutes one way. We saw England really struggle with it, but managed to overcome yeah. it when they beat Ireland. Let's see how it affects them. Wales kicking off into the wind. Game number five of six today. <laughs> Hannah Marshall. First touch for a Welsh player in this under 18. Six Nations Festival. France picking up where they left off against Scotland with a confident front foot back row carry. Lola Mitchell doing well. Lena Lamour. Snaffles that one. It's a good quick ball for France and half a gap here for Pisicelli to good. attack. They were quite reluctant to drop the ball on the toe for us in the first game, particularly with the wind at their back. They like to run it. Advantage offside number seven. Wales offside. Goyer over the game line. Ready, good intent from France. First minute. Wales a little bit too keen. <laughs> Number seven, offside. Lola Mitchell, offside. First penalty of the game. One minute into the game. Wales nil, France nil. Didn't take France long to score. That opener did it. First try, scored by Agnes Knoll. This is Brett. Number 17, she's on the bench for this one. Powerhouse prop forward. And Lea Guiton. This line out of the game. It's died down a little bit. You see it rustling through the AR's flag. Fanny off the top. Left, Lisa Guinness in midfield to try and punch a hole. Back the same way, Goyat. Whipped off the hand by Piscicelli, but it beats Kalea Bovoyet. He's not happy with the ball, they're absolutely delighted. You see there, there's a This is new. Jersey in the crowd. They're great guns in the men's game. Here we go, ten, Premiership. Ten. Is it this crowd? Premiership, both large and seen, with the Goglin covering. Not straight. First line out, not straight. Captain Millet. This is the mark. I'll, I'll be back. No worries. Back. Crouch. Bind. Set. First scrum then, James Williams and Hill for Wales, Mazoki Guiton and Folly too for France. Wales Ouch. put it. Bind! Set! Hold it! Hold it! Oh. Hawkins under a bit of pressure. Now Marshall takes it to the line, already looking to feed the speed. Wales and a Tudor brought down. Good tackle by Sibian. They get isolated here and won't as long as they keep offloading like that. Crystal James up over halfway. Yeah, Nest called off it. Flat ball by Anna Marshall, but France had straight offside. <laughs> Wales with their first bit of territory. Anna Marshall. Blue, red, 
highly Open, thought of Hannah Marshall, particularly in an attacking sense. Stay up in. Janelle Williams. She find her darts this time. Good. Off the top, it's a tidy ball, but it's good ball nonetheless. Heavy carry and a good tackle, but France yeah, over the ball, but just going off their feet. That was good. A lot more. Wales looking to go quickly here. Pierce. Advantage, not 10. They're not 10, France, and Wales looking to play through Hannah Marshall. Halfbacks linking up. Lola Mitchell playing on an advantage. Five minutes gone. Big opportunity for Wales. Crystal James. You still have advantage. Now Lily Hawkins, still the advantage. Chanel Williams. That's high. High tackle. Yeah. Yeah, one advantage here, the Second other there. Second stage to Lily Orchids. What do you want to play? Like she's a yeah, Labrador that's run away in the park. Back-to-back <laughs> -back penalties and Wales started to build something. Big chance now. Wales, but when you win these penalties, the pressure builds because you feel Out. as though you have to get something. Stay on. So Williams, two lineups, one successful. Not straight. It's not straight. <laughs> the theme of the day continues. France will have to put in the scrub. Here's the mark. Yeah. Crouch! Still nil nil. Find. Set. Hold it. Number nine, hold. Back. Up. The support Up. lines, absolutely yep. textbook. Please, I want a game. long and stable. Okay. Here's the mark. You have to wait. Okay. Crouch! Bind! Set! Okay. Let's get it. Yeah. Nest is there at number eight. Good pressure from Wales, but France looking to run this out. Trick away. Good tackle on any ball for no Hannah no Tudor. Hands, no hands. Number 13, it's high tackle. This time it's Here's Wales guilty of the high tackle. Hannah Tudor, and look at Karine Fanien. Doesn't fancy going for touch. France just want to run and want to play. It's a fast surface. Run! Why not? Run! Eight minutes gone. Lovely feet from Goyet. Tackle! France reluctant to drop it on the toe. They want to carry, and Genest can open the cat flap, and France can come away. Release! France have really got to have their wits about them here, because France have already shown they can go and score from anywhere, but that is sliced right. off the boots of Margot Sibien. The great line-out. Not going to be the end of the world for France. Please. Advantage knock on. Knock on off blue Wales ball and Anna Marshall. Over advantage away and France can come back from inside their own half. Emmy Baudreau. Smart kick in behind. Brilliant kick by Emmy Baudreau. Yes. Using the wind to her advantage. Yeah. Making one wonder why they haven't done that before inside their own 22. 50-22. Leah Guiton. 
it's her turn to contest with the wind. Wales have really struggled with. That is much better lineup for Witton. Finds Fanyen at the back to Goyat. Now, Tregoway. Good strength by Tregoway. Gets away from a couple of tackles. And off lows to Lamour. Lamour met by McCullen. But it's still with France. Elie Tregoway. You never release. And no clear release for Wales. Yes. Away goes Fanyen. Van Yen inside ball, France are over. Anna Daniel with the opening score. And they just play so much quicker than anyone else we've seen today. Particularly Paris Van Yen. Any opportunity, doesn't matter where it is on the pitch, she taps and she goes, and this time. She's got a big supporter in the shape of Anna Danielle. Everything good, girls. Is on the near side, 11 minutes gone, Wales nil, France five. They had numbers, France, and that's well taken by Wales. Back! Back! And then chipped it to touch. It's good. Tregway. getting away from tackles. Tregway still going. Offloading. Daniel's in for her second. Anna Daniel on the shoulder. France just not letting Wales breathe. The tempo is outstanding. They've silenced this vocal Welsh crowd, but look at this for a run, for an angle. Lane came to meet her, meet her, Banana Danielle on the shoulder. Two tries for the lock, how about that? And after a difficult start and an arm wrestle, France have settled in and Wales in deep trouble. Goyat. Makes no mistake this time. Two tries in two attacks. It is Wales nil. France 12. Look at this. Wales will not have been expecting France to go quickly, but from now on, you have to expect it with this French team. They play lightning quick. Marshall. Touch the ball. Okay. The post no twice. Players queuing up to carry, queuing up to breach the line. Here's Baudreau. Baudreau. Wales go a bit high. It's Daniel again. Daniel offloads to Perrine Fan Yen. They're chasing Fan Yen and they'll just stop her. Hannah Lane. Glorious tackle by Lane. And she wins the offload. That is outstanding from the Wales fullback. 
Perrine Fanien searching for a third try in two games. Chased all the way back by the Wales 15. No, no, Clay, it's it's penalty kick. Just say. She gets back on her feet and makes an excellent turnover. That is first class from Hannah Lane, but Wales have missed touch. And here is Bordreau again causing chaos. Back. PC Celli fumbles, but then a tackle's missed and Berroyer is away. Kalia Berroyer, serious gas from Berroyer, that's a high tackle. And Lily Hawkins Captain. might be going for a breather. Captain. That's a high tackle. Let's go. Well, I don't think Lily Hawkins can have too many complaints about that. Number nine. Beaten for pace. Scrum. It was an arm around the throat. Scrum. It's an orthodox French team. Decide to go for a scrum. It's a good shout. They are good up front. Creates the platform for these. Yeah. Time is off. Yes, look at the gas Good. from Berroyer. Lily Run. Hawkins. Give her space. Come on. Arm around the throat. Crouch. Bind. Set. And it comes from Fanyan. Options both ways. Into the 17th minute. Minute. And Goyat finds Tregway and Bordeaux is over for France's third. This is a statement performance from this French team. This is a good Wales team they are playing against and they are dismantling them every time they're on the ball. Here's the mark. Clinical passing off the left hand. Tregoway finds Bordreau. Misses from out wide, but Wales down to 14, down by 17. France going a best part of a point a minute. They have had a stuffing knockdown by this brilliant French team. Gouillard finding Tregoway. Just the speed of ball and the accuracy of the passing. Imi Baudreau gets her first try. Hannah Marshall gets his back underway. Zizi. Well, by Alain Pierce. Number four, seven. Wales need the next score for the corner. They just need some four. Lovely dummy again. Goyat after making the break, looking for the offload. No hand! She was good. She was the first one. Better strength by Wales. Interesting. Hannah Marshall. Off him for the corner. Touch, even though yeah. it's going great. Great. Let's touch with a couple of penalties and some tries. Crystal James right gives in. Janelle Williams the instruction. Six in the lineup for Wales. His advantage will come in the end. Off the blue hand, so Eve Hill. Run, the drop anchor in the France 22. Good carry by James, the offload. First knock on, Forward. second knock on. There's an advantage. No advantage coming, so it'll be a scrum to Wales. 
Because I'm not caught in the air. That's the mark. Just a reminder. This is the mark. Yeah. Day one, all of these games, 35 minutes, one way. Fast as furious. Crouch! France. Bind! 51 and points. Set! Against Wales and Scotland. Hold it! They are the business. Stay nine, stay nine. Hannah Marshall, Wales, stay. no scrum half. She's filling in at scrum half. Well, it dummies and getting dealt with by her opposite number. It's the kind of field position you could really do with a nine. Wales don't have one. Al Al Pierce. Counter up good, but Eve Gill can tidy up. Get advantage. Outside. Wales playing with an advantage. Looking to use some of this strength and pace that they have up front. Williams finds James. Wales. There's not advantage. Just knocking the ball on, but winning another penalty. Very different approaches to the game from these two teams as Wales crash it forward through Pierce. Offload is good. Gill stopped short. The advantage. Another advantage. France offside again. The ball just pops up from somewhere. No, it's short. Wales still short. Can't ground that ball. Someone needs to release it then. And they're over this time, Wales. Oh, they needed that. They're down to 14. They still found a way to get on the scoreboard. Chanel Williams. Some real bump and grunt about that. And well played by Wales in the end. Without their scrum yeah. half, they thought they'd already grounded it. Here's the mark. There's no dispute in that. Great. Chanel yeah. Williams gets Wales' his first try. With the conversion. No. Tough one into the wind. It remains Wales 5, France 17. <laughs> Charlie Goyat. Yeah. To the sun. It's a mark. Wales inviting this front team into the 22. Please on the bind, number eight. In. Crouch! Bind! Set! <laughs> Scrum that Guinness has to dig for but comes away with it now. Fan Yen finds Pisicelli yeah, yeah. but finds her illegally. Forward pass. Let off for Wales. Some, uh, ten minutes. That's a ten minute warning. For Wales. Crouch! Do something with it. Bind! Set! Hold it! Hold on! One score. Sets up for a grandstand finish. It's a good start. They've got the penalty. They want to try and inject some pace. Play advantage! It's not going advantage. I was expecting. No advantage. Please, stay up. Crouch! Another opportunity 
opportunity then for France. Set. Wales Hold back on. up to 15, still down by 12. Hold on. It's Blake. Evie Gill shuts down Yenest. Now needs to roll away. Number six, no rolling. You have advantage. Make any effort, so France have the penalty advantage. This high tackle. And then you have offside. Yeah. Oh, and here goes Pachin Fanier. What a player she is. Cut ten, please. We have too many. Uh, penalty kick. Please stop it. Can I have a talk? Seat? Yeah, talk with your team. Stop. One second. Time is up. Okay. Another try for France will surely Blue put this one beyond any doubt. They made a change in the front row. Well, followed two. A change in the front row, but a change to who is taking the line out. Now there's some width being put on it. Lovely hands between Fanier and Goyat Fanier back the other way. Mazoki. Fanier. Right and left and right again. The inside ball to Guinness. Wales have turned it over. Good work over the ball. Lola Mitchell. Yeah. Stop it. Time off. Said they weren't any daffodil hats. There's always one. Who's Wales rugby? It's the sun shining on a daffodil hat. Not brought them a lot of luck though. Wales has it. Nine minutes. Wales have been absolutely exemplary. They absorbed the early pressure. That was a very good Welsh team. Loose okay. and scores some fantastic tries. Thanks. We have a change, Mary. Please. Number 13. Festival, but in yeah. the meantime, they Katie Johnson yeah, sorry. is coming into the game. Was on hold on. Here's the mark. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here's the mark. Please hold your push, okay? Crouch! Bind! Set! No push! Okay. Lily Hawkins. Scrum by Wales. Looking for the offload. It's a risky one. But it's still in red hands. Hannah Marshall with the clearance kick. And now France. This is where they really seem to come into their own. Emmy Baudru up the left hand side, gliding through Baudru. Finds Berroyer. Berroyer, so dangerous. No high tackle that time. It's a high tackle on her in a similar position that led to the yellow card before, but Fan Yen finds Guinness. Approaching half an hour. No, hold. Back. Goyat. Oh, lovely offload. This is great handling by France. Hold back. Oh, just so comfortable on the ball. 
Marshall. Maybe a knock on. Yeah, just a knock, knock on. on. Genuine attempt to catch it. Five minutes to go. Come on. Crouch. Game of the day. Mind. Another game. Set. Really sure what they're all about it. Tuesday already. Seeing this team cut loose once more. Inside ball's a good one. Piscicelli. Bathed in glorious sunshine. Scores a glorious try. Faustine Piscicelli. Try number four for France. This is a really, really impressive outfit. Six minutes left. Two for Daniel, one for Bordrou, now one for Faustine Piscicelli on Yacht. the offload. Your time. Yeah. And then once you're in behind, it's so tough for Hannah Lane to do anything other than usher her in under the sticks. Another good one. Charlie Goyat doubles her tally for the match. They make her add to the conversion as we take another look at this centers combining. Tregui and Piscicelli. Good understanding, good partnership, good try. Tackle. Crystal James. Hold. As well in the end, but it's Treg away, causing chaos again. Zizi. Oh, leads the defender one, then the other. Run the Metcalf. It's the first one. Over though, in go Wales. Back, back. In search of something. Not the back door offload. Knock on. Knock on. When you're forcing it, it doesn't work. You find yourselves under the pump again, and that's exactly what's happened to Wales there. To mark. Come on, girls. Crouch! Set. Hold on. Now France, couple of minutes to go. Victory already in the bag. Advantage over. A little bit forward. Referee says no, and Berroyer is away again. Berroyer. A deadly finisher. But every touch she's had has looked like it's entirely designed to damage the opposition. She's getting in behind. Serious pace, that time she's hugged the touchline. We've seen her realize that it's not on before, so she's checked inside and created good quality ball. That time she knew it was on. Strong in the contact. Yeah. Great finish, great try. And this France team are going to take some beating. So there are two games on Tuesday. They've got Ireland at 2 o'clock and then Italy at 4.30 and then a mouthwater in prospect. They play England on Thursday. 70 minute game, the last game, so France versus England wins and Wales versus Italy wins. This 70 minute game, so 
trying to clear your diary. Watch those ones with us. They have got potential to be Let's get it. Hold on. In the red. Advantage. Knock on. In fact, we will have time for the final scrum. Thanks, Mary. Yeah. It's the last play. Last play then. Last chance last for play, Wales. Girls. Something from this game that started so brightly. France take control. Bind. It is over. Set. Lily Hawkins. With a yellow card after a high tackle on Berroyer. Perhaps disappears out of the back of Lily Hawkins. Tidies up. Marshall. Pierce. Ball this for Wales, good opportunity as well for Mitchell. Another loose Skirt. ball, still in Wales' hands. Yeah. The edge of the 22. It's Crystal James, Wales. We've got numbers here, just need to get the ball there. Oh, but Pierce checks inside instead of feeding Saren Jones. <laughs> Lily Hawkins. Wales looking for try number two, big bump, and they're over. Evie Hill with the try for Wales. Well, there's certainly a strength to this Wales team, but it has been outdone by the pace of the French. Huge power from Hill. Yeah, Ava Tonya met her, but momentum took her over. Seven tries. Good game, but France absolutely outstanding. 65 points in the two short games they've played. This will be the last act. Hannah Marshall. Yes. Draws that one in off the right post. France making two wins from two. Two impressive wins from two as well. They back up for 34 0 against Scotland with a 31 12 against the hosts, Wales. Wales have got a little over 20 minutes to dust themselves off before they go again against Scotland. That is, that is a message sent out by this brilliant French team. Tries for Jimmy Baudreau, for Faustine Piscicelli, Kalea Berroyer. A couple for Anna Daniel. How often do you see lock forwards scoring the first two tries of the game? Charlie Goyat. A couple of conversions as well. It was Chanel Williams and Evie Hill, two front rowers. On the score sheet for Wales. Very much a day for the type five forwards. Very much a day for France. They're the only team. We're going to close proceedings with two wins from two. One game still to go. Scotland versus Wales, both looking for their first victory of the under 18 Six Nations Festival. But it is done and dusted here. We will leave you with the highlights. The full time score France 31, Wales 12.